This week on Daily Architecture News. Designed by local architecture firm Ritz & Borgassian, Prior is a chic neighbourhood cafe that opened its doors to Melbourne in early 2020. Observing Neatry from the street, the building is crowned by typically Art Deco detailing. Dramatic black windows frame the entrance of the 130-seat cafe, while an equally theatrical awning is emblazoned with the cafe's name. Stepping inside, the interior space basks in another kind of light, one of typically Australian feel where the designers curated clean-lined fixtures and fittings beneath soaring, white-painted cathedral ceilings. A leather banquette lines the perimeter wall opposite the open kitchen. The central fireplace is on standby, ready to warm the mitts of patrons during the depths of Melbourne winters. The world's first coral arc is planned for Port Douglas in far north Queensland, the gateway to the Great Barrier Reef. Developed in collaboration with the Great Barrier Reef legacy, the Living Coral Biobank would spearhead the preservation of vital marine ecosystems that are under threat from climate change. Designed by Contreras Earl Architecture, the form of the Living Coral Biobank is inspired by a type of mushroom coral, recognised for its distinctive protective radial fins. Inside, the building would see the safe storage and breeding of about 800 species of the world's hard corals. Taking its inspiration from the dream of two young entrepreneurs to open their own restaurant, La Sastreria is a wondrous establishment in Valencia, Spain, designed by local creative consultancy and interior design firm, Musca Spacio. Located in the maritime neighbourhood of Valencia, the bar at La Sastria features a frenzy of custom-made tiles. Here, almost every surface confidently displays a patchwork of high-octane patterns, produced with tiles that reinterpret the similarly energetic facades of the neighbouring buildings. While the bar outwardly references the architectural characteristics of the surrounding neighbourhood, the restaurant at La Sastria takes its cues from the blue and white tones of the nearby ocean. The designers responded to the restaurant's menu of ocean-focused fare by creating a huge wave sculpture that builds momentum as it approaches the kitchen, culminating in a showpiece made of suspended ceramic objects. And finally this week, luxury automotive manufacturer Aston Martin and visionary architect Sir David Adjaye have united to create a collection of five exclusive homes at 130 William in New York. The buyers of the five luxury homes will also be able to travel in style in a Sir David Design Special Edition Aston Martin DBX. Sir David is responsible for the holistic vision of the 66-storey 130 William building, designing its iconic exterior as well as all of its interiors, which includes 242 residences. You can read about all of these stories and more online now at dailyarchitecturenews.com.